I just finished doing my first uh, laser distraction live stream last Wednesday and I noticed after I went back and watched some of the recording that uh, this little webcam that I have right here to uh, show the laser cutting it was having trouble focusing and it's because there's not enough light in this laser it just has this one little LED strip underneath the gantry here so today I'm, I bought some uh, 24 volt uh, strip lighting that just uses uh, adhesive to, uh, to stick on so I'm going to first clean these rails right here with some acetone and get ready to wire up some more lighting That's pulling. That's pulling all of that off. Okay, you might have been able to tell right over there on that corner, the uh, this blue stuff kind of tore off. And then when I thought I was getting it started again, and went to pull it off and then stick it over there in that corner, I realized that the sticky part had actually come off with the the little blue tape. So. I've got a section there, maybe a 12 inches or so, where there's no sticky stuff, but I restarted it and got it, uh, all of this, although it's not on there really straight, it is uh, all stuck on there pretty good, so I don't think that'll be a problem, and if it is, I'll just come back and put some double-sided tape. Okay, I put some, uh, another red and black wire attached to, uh, what came on is because it was only about that long and I've run it down through this hole right here where the wires go from the controller and I tied it into the 24 volts right here I'll put some pictures up here to show uh, that little terminal block that I tied into and I did check it with my meter before I uh, wired that up to make sure I got it right but it's like they just have a 24 volt positive and negative coming down for that little terminal block uh, and then making that where they can run some other 24 volt things off of that. So easy to tie that in. And now the moment of truth. Let's see. Uh, let's see if it's going to work. <laughs> difference you can see everything down in there now even with the cover closed 
it's got kind of a more of an amber glow to it, but uh, yeah, that really brightens it up, so it's going to be able to uh, make it nice for recording with this uh, webcam right overhead here. Man, what a difference a little lighting makes, huh? If you'd like to check out that live stream that I was talking about earlier, it's called Laser Distractions, and it's every Wednesday night at 8.30 p.m. It's some special content that I do for my channel members, so if you want to check it out, hit the little join button down below and become a channel member, and then you can see the live, raw, uncut version of the live stream. And if you'd like to check out one of these awesome OMTEC laser machines, I am an affiliate for OMTEC, so I have a link to their website down below in the video description, as well as a coupon code that will get you some money off on your total purchase. So if you want to check those out, be sure and uh, use that link down below. And I guess that's going to do it for this one. If you'd uh, like to check out these lights that I uh, purchased, I have a link down below in the video description, as well as for all the other things I've done for uh, add-ons for this machine. If you're not already subscribed to my YouTube channel, you might want to consider doing so. Just hit the subscribe button down below and make sure you hit that little bell so you get a notification every time I upload a new video. And until the next one, thank you very much for watching.